The prosecutor of the International Criminal Court has arrived in Georgian capital, Tbilisi, to investigate both sides in a 2008 war between Russia and Georgia for crimes including the killing of peacekeepers and attacks on civilians. This comes after Georgia's own inquiries into its forces' alleged crimes had reportedly stalled. No, I just, on the 13th of October, I made an application to the judges of the ICC to request for authorization to be able to open investigations in the situation in Georgia in August of 2008. Investigations in Russia already underway may not be subject to the ICC. But Ben Suda says the prosecutor's office will have full rights to the probe taking place in Georgia. Um, I, can, I can tell you that with respect to the Rome Statute, uh, we, uh, we have, uh, Georgia is a state party to the Rome Statute. Therefore, any crimes, alleged crimes that have occurred on the territory of, of Georgia, we will have uh, um, the, the, the jurisdiction to be able to look into that, no matter what nationality that person is. Prosecutors say that there is evidence that up to 113 ethnic Georgians were killed and up to 18,500 uprooted from their homes as part of, quote, a forcible displacement campaign conducted by the authorities in South Ossetia, a mainly Russian-speaking breakaway region. They said that according to their estimates, the ethnic Georgian population in the conflict zone was reduced by at least 75 percent and that the crimes had been committed with, quote, the possible participation of the Russian armed forces. Prosecutors say there is also evidence that Georgian and South Ossetian forces both attacked peacekeepers. The Georgian Justice Ministry says it plans to cooperate with the international investigators. Uh, we, of course, will be cooperating with the Hague prosecutor because for us it's very important that um, the Hague Tribunal, ICC, can recognize established facts about the ethnic cleansing of Georgians in the South Ossetia during the Russia Georgia War 2008, and we do all remember that not only ethnic cleansing was uh, took place at that time, but Georgian property was destroyed of those families, families were split, and also we had many soldiers who were tortured, uh, kept in custody, and some of those killed. Judges must now decide whether to authorize a full probe into the alleged atrocities in Georgia. This comes as The Hague is already considering whether to open an investigation into crimes committed in East Ukraine, where government forces are fighting a Russian-backed insurgency.